The next thing I'm going to show you goes perfectly over that, which is my Vapor eyeshadow. And it's a, it's a whitish pinky with a, just a tiny bit of shimmer. It's the perfect highlight. I think it's the perfect highlight for my skin. I've been looking for a color like this for a long time. And I do think it meets up with the highbrow just great. Which I'm sure, you know, if you blend out the highbrow, you could use that as a highlighter as well and not do anything else. But I really like Vapor. And I also got Soft Brown from MAC, which I think this is a staple. I, you know, I have been looking for a dupe for this color for a long time because I really didn't want to spend $14.50 on just like a brown eyeshadow, which, I mean, I've said before, I do like MAC, but I'm not a MAC-aholic. Every eyeshadow I have doesn't have to be MAC or anything like that. And, um, you know, I do prefer like Urban Decay eyeshadows or even the uh, Coastal Scents palettes. Sorry, I'm looking over there. They're, they're over there. Um, the Coastal Scents palettes, I think, are great. Any eyeshadow that works, I don't, you know, have to spend $14.50 on an eyeshadow. But, you know, if, if it's worth it, then I definitely don't have a problem with it. And I think that soft brown is one of those staple things you have to have. But if you guys know of a dupe for soft brown, please, please leave me a comment. Let me know. Um, moving on to my favorite things from MAC, which are blushes. I love MAC blushes. You know, I think, I think everybody has their own like brand of blushes that is their favorite. And for me, it's, it's MAC. When I walk up to the MAC counter, all I can even look at are the blushes. So, um, let's see. I did do some swatches for you guys if they haven't rubbed off. Let's see. I will start with my very favorite, which is Sun Basque. And here's what it looks like in the pan. And it is kind of like a goldeny, peachy with gold shimmer. I, I just really love it. And to me, it's really natural on my skin. I'm also wearing that today. So, and here's the swatch. The very first one. I love this. And I think that uh, I will probably wear this all summer. And next is a really unique blush. This is Gentle. It's a mineralized blush. Oh, why can't I open stuff today? Sorry. And MAC describes it as a raspberry colored blush with um, silver shimmer. And it is pretty much exactly that. I really like this a lot. And it is right here. And when I was in the MAC store, I was looking at getting Plum Foolery. And seriously... Um, gentle can be built up to look just like plum foolery. So I uh, just wanted to let you guys know that. The next one is a sheer tone shimmer blush. Where is it? Oh, sorry. It's a sheer tone shimmer, and this is Spring Sheen. Again, with the opening. Okay, sorry. <laughs> and this is a pink blush with a little, well, it's a peachy pink blush with gold shimmer. Can you guys tell I like things with gold shimmer? And this is it right here. Number three. One, two. This one right here. Number three. Oh, I'm sorry about the lighting, guys. I've tried to record this a few times now. I don't know what's up with my camera. And so now the lighting is going. So, sorry. Um, I think Spring Sheen is, of course, perfect for spring. But the cool thing about this one is that it looks really good on a lot of skin tones. Um, I have some girlfriends who are definitely a different skin tone than me. Like I mentioned, I'm NC35. I've got um, one girlfriend that's an NC25. It looks great on her. And then I have another friend who's an NC45, and it's great on her as well. So I think it's a really versatile blush and one that everybody should have. And um, the next one I have is Improvise. And that one... It is a mineralized blush, and it is disappearing on me. Let's see. There we go. Let's see if you guys can see that. And it is like a peach color. And there it is. Oh, I just think that's so pretty. There you go. There. There's the angle. And it is like, it's got lots of veining, like peachy gold with a tiny bit of pink and um, gold shimmer. Love it. And the last one I have is a matte blush. And this one is Blush Baby. Sorry, my 
Here we go. Maybe you guys can see that. There we go. There's Blush Baby. And um, here it is in the pan. Like I mentioned before, it's a matte blush. And uh, this one is like a like a brownish pink. I really like this one. I think it also looks really natural on your skin. It looks, you know, kind of like you're just lightly flushed. And I do really like that. i um, also got Soft and Gentle. I have been dancing around this one for a while too. I wasn't really into highlighters for a while, but I guess I'm kind of starting to be into them. And since summer's coming, I kind of want that little bit of shimmer. So this is Soft and Gentle. And here it is on my finger. It's just a really nice highlight color. And if you're really, really careful and you use a very light hand, maybe like a fan brush, you can add a little bit of this to your whole face just to give you a little bit of um, glow. And let's see, what else did I get? Oh yeah, uh, with my Ultra Reward Points, I got these sunglasses from Franco Sarto. This is the case they came in. And it was, really no it was really nice of them to give me the case, even though I got the sunglasses for free. But the people in my altar are really nice. And here are the sunglasses. Ooh, they're like a brown with a tortoise shell. And the... Anywho, here's what they look like. I kind of think they might be a little bit big for my face, but I love the whole movie star look. And I love the little detail on the side. Let me know what you guys think. You know, you always need opinions about sunglasses. I hate to go, like, shopping by myself. I'm one of those people who needs lots of input. So, if you can, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. And, oh, yeah. Other two things I've got are, is this um, DKNY oh, perfume. Be Delicious. And they've got several of these. I think there's four of them. And some of them... The whole thing is like an apple theme. I think one of them was like Red Delicious and there was a green one. But I don't really like fruity scents. So the one I got is um, Fresh Blossom. And it's pink. So I got that one at Ulta. And then um, from Belk. My husband actually went out late, right before Belk closed to get this whenever we smelled a sample of it. And this is from Coach, the new Coach perfume. And I swear it smells just like honeysuckle. Oh, it is awesome. Um, I've got a review coming up on these two perfumes. So if you want to know more about those, check that out. And I think that's about all I've got for you. Oh, yes. What do you guys think about my hair? I know it's a little weird. Um, totally inspired by the Final Fantasy 13 which my husband has been playing since it came out. His name is Drew, by the way. Um, so this is from a character called Vanille, and she's really kind of cool and quirky and very feminine. But what I like about it is it can be messy or whatever, and you don't have to worry about it. So if you're in a hurry, this is kind of easy. Just throw your hair up in some ponytails and um, put some curls in, and there you go. So what do you guys think about it? Leave me a comment. Let me know. I hope you guys enjoyed and have a great day. Bye.